Welcome to Paranormal Entities. I actually have no idea what this is. <laughs> okay, let me read this real quick. I'm gonna move myself out the way this time. Actually do this, yes. You thought I wouldn't be able to. You thought, no, no, no. Spookster will never ever move themselves away while reading, but I'm gonna prove you wrong. I did this before on a video that you should totally watch. If you haven't, go watch. And if you have, Go watch! You are Cliff, a college student who is a brand new freelance cameraman for the show Paranormal Entities. You have been hired to inspect the St. Augustine Asylum for the Mentally Ill. You will go into the facility, follow the producer's instructions through a radio earpiece, keep your camera on and try to make contact with the spirits inside. If you manage to get some amazing footage of paranormal activity on your camera, then th then what? That, it, it, it's just, that's just a comma. That's not a period. It's just, what? Then what? I don't know. <laughs> oh. All right, Clint, uh, Cliff, 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 welcome to the St. Augustine's Asylum for the Mentally Ill. Yeah. Our producer Tom said good things about you. In your backpack is a flashlight, a voice recorder, an EMF, and a couple of little fun occult things. We'll let you know when to take those out. Uh, I know it's kind of weird, but I really like that picture frame. When you're done, can you bring that with you? I have that on tape. I'm not going to record myself doing a crime. This is where the 100 hallways patients would convene. And we heard that the patients pre-1920 actually- I can't even interact with the door. He took my hands as well. What? Chief, I think we're on to something. That's some spooky content right there, baby! Alright, this is a good place to start. I want you to take out your voice recorder, and I'll hopefully be able to awaken this place. Okay, spirits of St. Augustine, please reveal your presence to us. Feel free to interact with anything, or speak to us. Let us know that you're here. Okay, play that back. Uh, nothing. Alright, let's try that again. Hold on, I want to talk. I can finally be the bootleg of Ryan and Shane. Wait, so I can't just use my own voice? Do I not speak? All right, all right, let's try this. Ghosts of St. Augustine, please let us know that you are still in this hospital. I give you permission to reveal yourself. I give you permission to come to life. Just give us a sign that you're here. Tell us where you are. Speak to us now into this microphone. Alright, let's try one more spot. Look, I've watched my sheer bit of BuzzFeed Unsolved, Supernatural. I've watched Ryan go absolutely ham thinking that magic box told words. <laughs> but when going on a ghost hunt, let's just say, in the sense of an argument, hypothetically, if ghosts are real, shouldn't you not demand things should you just be very respectful i mean yeah of course you could always play shane you're best of free ghosts of saint augustine you're all a bunch of ghoulish pricks show up or piss off oh, ho, 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 ho. all right all right we, looks like we got an investigation all right i want you to go down the morgue hallway and we're gonna continue our investigation in the other gathering area. No, no, no. What a f***. What a f***. Am I alone in this? Why isn't the producer here with me? I never said anything. Ghosts of this asylum, I want to make it clear. He did it, not me. I am not at fault. Okay, the four areas you need to visit to the East Social area is the first on the list. This is the area where the inmates who were deemed a danger to society would convene. You'll go to this room and perform a summoning ceremony. <laughs> so walk into the center and we will begin. This is the entrance to the patient cells 220 to 240. This is where they kept the lunatics, the murderers, the sociopaths. The worst of the worst, including Clive the Peeper Johnson. He was extremely manipulative and very intelligent. He was a murderer and a memer. Most of his victims could never identify him because he managed to convince them to gouge 
their own eyes out with metal wires and even their own fingernails. Let's just start the ceremony. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I see. Spirits inside this asylum, we know that you're here. We release you from your restraints. Come forward and live again. This person is no longer shielded from the realm of the dead. You may be seen, interact, and manipulate him in any way as you see fit. Oh. What's... Oh. Don't just stand there. Go, go check it out. <laughs> All right. Solo investigation, baby. So, so, okay, well, I was gonna say maybe they were inviting me to sleep, but I, I guess that's a hard no. I guess no sleep. Okay, well, I, I saw you. Don't worry. I'll catch up with you later. Hi, how's it going? Are you like the ghost of grandpa? Hey girl, how's it going? Been searching you forever. <laughs> no, 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 no. You can't, <laughs> you can't put the f***ing scary smart face manipulator in my face, dude. No, that does not work. Oh my f***ing god. Get the hell out of there. Go to the front door and get out. Alright, get out of this hallway and then take a take your second right. I know where to go. Doors locked, damn it, damn it. Oh, okay, there's a, there's a staircase. Take this staircase up to the second floor, and you should be next to a fire escape. You should be able to get out that way. So so go up the staircase. Can't go down there. Okay. Ooh, 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 mm, mm, mm. No, I don't like that. No, I think that's the scariest thing I've seen so far in this game. That doesn't work. Crap, uh, okay, we need to, let's go get something to pry this door open. Go back downstairs. I, I bet you there was something downstairs we could probably use. That was not there before. Hold on, hold on. That staircase wasn't there before. This place doesn't even have a basement. What, what is going on? He says nothing about this? Oh, oh, no, I... Oh, no, what did I do? No, where did... Uh-uh, where did I press? Okay. <laughs> the second scariest thing right now. No, you can talk... No, 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 you can let it all out. You can talk to me. Sometimes you just gotta let it all out. Oh, you done? Are you, are you done? You good? Hey, I, I'm gonna be right back. I'm not gonna go and disappear. I'm gonna be right back. I just need to go down this hallway because there's some mood lights on the floor and I need to really check those out. I told you I would be back in a second. God damn it. Look, it's not my fault that this asylum has teleporting hallways. I, I don't know. All I could know is I'm gonna be back clipping into the no, the uh, no, and uh, back clicking it, back clipping into the no rooms. Yeah, that could be no clipping into the back rooms again. No eyes, don't see. No eyes. No. Ghost door? Are you trapped in here? Where's that coming from? Oh, hi. Oh. Ghost door, save me. Oh. Alright, confession time. Uh, it's about the eyes. I kind of hid this from you. There's an urban legend, and I, I repeat, it's an urban legend about the peepers, and you see the, 
There was a patient who suffered from dementia and swore that Clyde was more than just a mere man, and uh, he would kind of haunt this patient all throughout the day. Then he discovered that if he closed his eyes, he could escape Clive. But whenever he opened them, Clive would be there, waiting for him and getting closer and closer. Eventually, the patient used a fork and he blinded himself. And while he was soaked in his blood, he screamed to the entire hospital that he was free. He was safe. So, try to get the hell out of there and if it gets too intense, try to shut your eyes. Oh. Damn flashlight broke. I can't use that anymore. Hey look buddy, next time, next time you're going in there, okay? Just saying. Yeah? What? What? I did- was I supposed to see someone? Hi. I mean, there's like no one there. What? You got a choice. Either he gets you, or you're you're gonna have to cut him out. What are you even? Can I see you, please? No, 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 no. I like my eyeballs. Look up my two eye colors. This is it, man. Make your decision now. What's it gonna be? This is all baloney, man. He can't hurt. Look, he's so ca he can't hurt me. Come on, man. Jokes on them. Me and him teamed up. I liked it. It had cheap spooks here and there. Not saying this was bad. Not at all. This was a really good experience. If you want to play this video game for yourself, please go check it out. It is in the description below. And if you liked this video and want to see more from yours truly, then please do consider subscribing and hitting the bell. It would mean a lot to me. And... I hope you have a very, very good day. Bye-bye. <laughs>